Hello and welcome to the second last week in our Financial Abundance Month. If you've missed any of the videos so far, you can check them out on YouTube at Saffron de Menezes Coaching and Card Reading. Um, and you can probably find them through the Facebook page, though maybe not so easily. Um, this week's is a really good one. We're going to talk about fear of success. So last week we discussed fear of failure, which I think a lot of us are very familiar with. Um, but fear of success can be a bit more elusive. Lots of us have it but don't realise that we have it. Lots of us have never even heard of it. Um, so it sounds quite counterintuitive when we're trying to do something that we might fear succeeding at it. So why might that be the case? Well, there are a number of different reasons, but I'm going to talk about two of the most common today. So one of them is the fear of losing our social group. If we're in a social group where we're all at a very same, very similar financial level, um, and we don't want to lose that group, you know, it's where we've got our emotional connections, it's our community, and those are our people. Um, and this can include a family, if it's your family, that is all at a very similar financial level. There can be some fear in um, achieving a higher level of success than them because and particularly if it's a social group that's got some kind of um, distaste around the idea of people who are successful, rich people. Um, if you've got that going on you certainly don't want to become a rich person um, and see all of your friends decide that you're not part of their group anymore because ugh, rich person. Um, so that's one of the reasons and another reason that's very common is a fear of being visible generally if we're successful particularly if we're successful in business but also if we're successful within someone else's business working our way up a big company um, we become more visible we have more employees we have more um, people that answer to us um, and also we might be more in the public eye, we might be promoting ourselves in order to promote our business. Um, we want to get well known so that we can get clients or students or however we work, whatever our um, business is. And there can be a lot of fear around that because if everyone can see us, then we feel very exposed um, and that doesn't always feel safe and we're opening ourselves up to criticism if people don't like what we do and we've put it out there for everyone to see particularly with social media and via the internet and things there's a lot of opportunity for people to say something nasty and that can hold us back and that can happen it's something that we need to be okay with really if we're going to run a business if we're going to use social media we need to be able to ignore that um, and so there's um, a bit more about that in my video about um, tapping for when you care too much what other people think um, but let's look at both in our tapping script today so let's begin on the karate chop point even though I'm afraid of becoming too successful, I would encourage you to tap along with this even if it doesn't resonate with you because um, often we don't recognise that we have a fear of success and when we start tapping we think, ah, actually this little bit sounds familiar um, and it's good just to investigate. If you don't have the fear, it's not going to give you the fear, um, it just gives you the opportunity to make fully sure that you don't have that fear. So back to the tapping. Even though I have this fear of success and of everyone seeing what I'm doing, that's okay. I love and accept myself exactly as I am. And even though I have this big fear of becoming successful, and of losing my social group, my friends and my family, that's okay. I accept that I have these fears and I love and accept myself exactly as I am. 
even though I'm very fearful of achieving such a level of success that I can no longer relate to my friends and they can no longer relate to me that's okay I love and accept myself exactly as I am I'm frightened to succeed I'm frightened of the losses it might bring I'm frightened of the criticism it might bring I would be very visible and I don't really want to be seen I don't want everyone commenting on me I would rather just stay hidden I really don't want to be seen if I become successful I might be very visible it feels really dangerous it doesn't feel safe to be successful I'm frightened of being too visible and I'm frightened of the losses as well I'm frightened I might not be able to connect with my friends that they might not want me to be part of their group they won't be able to relate to me if I become too successful we won't be able to bond over shared problems my problems will be different from theirs I might lose my friends I might no longer be part of that social group I'm worried about what might happen if I become too successful deep breath so if anything came up for you there make a note of it and that's where you need to work next um, I did just want to share that for me something did come up there and it was the thought of my brother who is extremely successful and still has all of his friends um, so that's really positive and um, it shows that that can happen and you can still keep your group and relate to them regardless of your circumstances um, so I would love to hear if anything came up for you and what you took from that um, if there's any questions or comments or you would like me to clarify anything then please do let me know you can email me on saffron at saffrondemonizes.com you can visit the website at www.saffrondemonizes.com um, you can visit our Facebook page at um, Saffron Demonizes Coaching and Card Reading and um, our YouTube um, channel is has the same title so I look forward to hearing from you very shortly and enjoy your tapping <laughs>